Hey guys, welcome to Spark Academy Home Edition. I'm Emily. And I'm Hannah. And we are going to be showing you guys a really fun thing that you can do today with your family at home, um, in your yard, to be active, be outside. It's such nice weather right now. Um, and we want you guys to just enjoy the day, enjoy uh, your time at home. So we're going to be showing you a really fun relay race that you can do. Um, you can do it by yourself. It's cool if you have at least two people. Um, and so we're going to show you what it looks like with two people. So all you need is two bowls full of water. If you don't have bowls, you can use buckets. You can use anything that can hold water like this and that's big enough for you to be able to get your hand inside. Yes. And because you're going to be doing this outside, make sure it's not something like glass or something that's going to break. So these are plastic bowls that we're using. You're also going to need two cups, again. Or other bowls. Or other bowls. Again, plastic. And lastly, two sponges. Now, you can use sponges that you already have lying around your house. It's better if you have sponges that have not been used yet. But ask your parents. They'll give you the best sponges to use. It doesn't matter what kind of sponge you use. These could be bath sponges or dish sponges, but you have to make sure that to keep it fair, both of the teams have the same kind of sponge. Yes. And now what you're going to be doing in this relay race, we each have one of each of these things. So we each have a bowl of water, we each have a plastic cup, and we each have a sponge. And we are going to be transferring the water from the bowl to the cup. But how are we going to do that? We're going to use the sponges. So what you want to do is you want to set up your bowls and your cups a certain distance away from each other. So my bowl is going to come back here on this grill. And we're going to put these cups on some picnic tables that are a little bit further away. We're going to weigh them down with something heavy so that they don't blow away in the wind. All right. So we have our bowls of water set up. We have our cups set up and we put a couple rocks in them, the same size rocks so that it's fair. And I'm going to be starting at this red bowl and going across to that cup. And Hannah is going to be starting at this orange bowl and going across to this cup. And so Hannah, how far do we have to fill up our cups? We have to fill our cup all the way to the very top the very top water has to be spilling out of the top of the cup okay are you ready for this i'm ready may the best woman win yes. on your mark get, get set, set go good exercise it so was. in that sense we both won yeah we have earned ourselves the grand prize of staying healthy yes doing some cardio. so you guys can try this at home do it with your do it with your parents do it with your siblings um really just have fun with it you can put them as far apart or as close together as you want um and if you're playing by yourself you can try to time yourself to see how long it takes you to do it and then try again the next day and the next day and see if you can get a little bit faster yeah or maybe you can try and get a bigger cup or a bigger bowl to fill. Who knows? It's up to you. Yeah. All Just right. go nuts with it. Have yeah. a lot of fun. Um, and if your parents are okay with it, you may be able to do this inside if you're not going to be getting the carpet wet. Yes. Yes. But make sure you ask your parents first. Yes. All right. Cool. All huh? right. Cheers. Cheers. Don't drink that. Nope. Don't. Nope. Don't drink bad, bad idea. The water's dirty. Yeah. Do <laughs> All right. Well, until we see you next time, stay safe. Stay well.